This is a real quick video on a portable uh, air conditioner that just stopped working. Um, normally it draws around 900 to 1200 watts when it's running and I've had it since 2007. It just quit in the sense that it's not blowing any cold out. So taking the whole thing apart and it does have a nice extension cable right here. Over here is a schematic And what I found just real briefly is that the there's no continuity between the red wire and the black wire, which goes through the uh, clicks on over temperature. So it's like the compressor wasn't there. So over here, it was getting power to the compressor, but there was no wasn't really turning on. So first I thought it was a capacitor, and before I did that, I popped off the top here which has got the over temperature sensor right here over temperature clicks on and this terminal is a white this one just had tons of crud on it you can see here the terminals burned off so once I've cleaned that off I can go between these two terminals which is the white and the red and I've got about 2.7 ohms with the 8060A so I'm going to go ahead and uh, get some new lugs and shine this up. What happened is that if it would have had a leak, I would have smelled the Freon and seen a bunch of oil on here. But there's no leak. This is an old 420 uh, R22 unit. And so it just abruptly stopped. And the power consumption, he just dropped to uh, 50 to 80 to 100, depending on what the fan setting was. So it was something basic. First thought it was the relay but it had power to the relay here so it's just the uh, connector got boogered up and with time it just gets eaten up and that can happen where you get a little bit of corrosion condensation because it's humid here and once it starts to get a bad connection it just thermally goes away so this is a hermetic seal on here and I can buzz between all three of these and it's got good continuity so I don't think I got a problem with the compressor and I'll probably check the cap too, but this literally got burned off because of the connection got screwed up. That's what it's got on there, ARC14H. This is a 14,000 BTU, 9.8 amps cooling. And this was supposed to have a uh, energy EER rating of 12.7, which is really high. This unit's got here is it has a drain here and then normally if this is unplugged up so you don't drain it then it goes through and has two positions the first click click position turns on a pump second one turns off the complete unit so you don't flood the floor and what it's got over here is it actually has a pump this pump re recirculates water up around the coil here to give it an extra boost and so the higher efficiencies because it's recirculating water and pre-cooling uh, the refrigerant here. So you get a little bit of boost down there. It's using some of the pan water. Now if you drain out with this, then it's never going to outrun the pump. And then you're not going to have any, uh, the efficiency is not as high. This portable AC is an ARC14H. 9.8 cooling has an EER of 12.7 but that's a little bit hokey because they don't consider the makeup but this was a $600 unit back in 2007